Hi everyone, this is Amy with P.E.'s and I've been naughty. But if we don't tell anyone it'll be fine. I had a hamster cage from when I had two Russian dwarfs. And it's the Mini Duna. Yeah. And I went into Pets at Home today. And <laughs> they had Syrian hamsters. And the Pets at Home woman said that it'd be big enough, but it's clearly not. So I'm going to make her a bin cage in the next few days. But for now, I'm sure it'll be fine. But yeah, but remember this is temporary so don't go flaming me because I realise it's small. But this is Hollyhock. I named her Holly because she is my Christmas baby. <laughs> She's 12 weeks old and she is a Syrian hamster. <laughs> She's crazy. But yeah, this is her cage for now. Like I said, it's very, very temporary. She has a house and a wheel but I'm going to get her a really big wheel because as you can see it's a bit small for her her cube and her food bowl and her oop, and her bottle and her cup of soup box and some wooden chews at the back should we take this off and see if she'll have a look oh I haven't cleaned my room yet so she's currently on my bed but hollyhock Holly! Come on, Holly! Come see! Come see! <laughs> also, I've had to separate Poppy and Phoebe because they were fighting and Phoebe pretty much tried to take a chunk out of Poppy. Yeah! So, my mum decided that she would like to adopt Phoebe from me because they're now in separate cages and I live in a student house. So I get to see Phoebe all the time still, but she's going to live with my mum and my dad. I wouldn't give her up to just anyone. Like, I would have kept her and just not had any room for me. Because she's special and I wouldn't want just anyone to take care of her. Because I wouldn't trust just anyone. But my mum already has a pig and he's called Brian. He's very handsome. But they're not going to live together just yet because Brian's not neutered and Phoebe isn't spayed. But maybe in the future, hey. But Phoebe seems quite content on her own, so is Poppy. I think Poppy's a lot smaller. Yeah. But my boys are still happy. And... I've got Holly. Holly, Holly, Holly. Oh. <laughs> but yeah. She has a cup of soup box that she likes to run in. I say likes, I've literally had it about an hour. And I went in pets at home for a wander and two carry cases. And I came out with Hollyhock. I blamed the pets at home lady because she said to me, um, would you, I was holding them just to see what they were like. Doing a bit of research. And she said, would you like to take this one home? And I said, well, she went, well, you don't want to leave her for Christmas, do you? Yeah, thanks for that, love. Yeah. And that, did you know that hamsters eat toast? I don't mean, like, buttered, jammed toast. I mean, just toast. I didn't know that. I found that out today. It's quite random. The pets that own woman told me. So, I'm going to read up lots about Miss Hollyhock. Yeah, I'm going to make her a bigger cage because, well... I didn't realise how small the cage was compared to the hamster. Because obviously Russian dwarves are a lot smaller. But, yeah. But I'm sure she'll be fine for like a couple of days if I buy her a bigger wheel tomorrow. Because that wheel is not big enough for the hamster. The hamster is a, is a bit of a giant. But yeah. So I shall be getting rid of this cage. Hopefully. I'm putting her in a storage bin cage. I find it really funny that she's just running around and watching me. She'll go in for a close up. I can't talk while I'm doing this, but we will see Hollyhock.
<laughs> no, she's gone into hiding again. But yeah. Oh, there we go. Clever girl. Clever girl. She's such a little daredevil. She just throws herself around. She doesn't even care. She doesn't care. No. And she doesn't use a ladder. She doesn't have to. Come on, Hollyhock. There we go. So yeah, this is my hamster. Holly is going to live on my desk when I've cleaned it because at the minute it's full of rubbish and ha. Ah. Oh Holly, what are you doing? I'm also going to make her a felt cube to hang from the bars. So she has an extra place to hide. Yeah. I don't really buy felt things because it's like I can make them. It's not difficult. But yeah, this is her cage for now. Yeah. I've not... <laughs> little nose. I've not properly held her yet because they need a couple of days to settle in, don't they? I'm very tempted, I'm not going to lie. I'm very, very tempted to pick her up and play. But I should give her a space. Because she is a massive hamster. Yeah. <laughs> With a cup of soup box. Like I said to my housemates when I got back, everyone needs to go to the toilet more so I can have some loo roll tubes. I think they thought I was joking. Uh, no, I'm serious. Yeah. So that's that for now. I will update you when I get a bigger cage. Yeah. So I think that's it. You've updated on my pigs. And on my hamster. So... Yeah. Bye for now.